Today we're going to be doing an unboxing of the Tri Beauty Box for December. This is the box that was done in collaboration with Angelica. I love Angelica. I'm so proud of you. I know you're probably going to watch this. I will of course have her channel linked down below in my description box. Now she did reach out to me and say that I was going to receive this box in PR and that she sent it to my PO box. Uh, this was in my mailbox because I am subscribed to Tribe and she didn't know that. So I probably am going to get two boxes, but I will probably give the other one away. I don't know when that's coming. I don't even know if it's coming. I'm pretty sure it is. But as of this very moment, this is the box that I have. This is the box that I'm going to open up. Obviously, as you can tell, I already have a bunch of makeup on my face, so we're not going to try on any of these products for today's video. Now, I actually don't have any highlighter on because I am waiting for my Jeffree Star mystery box to come, and I know there's going to be a highlighting palette in that box, but I still wanted to film this video, so if I'm not wearing any highlighter, that's simply why. But let's go ahead and rip into this box because I'm very excited. I haven't even looked at any of the spoilers. I did not watch Angelica's video where she talked about the products that were in it. I only watched the intro, so I don't know anything about any of these products in this box. I am very, very excited. So let's go ahead and get into this. And there is a card up top here and it has a picture of Angelica and it looks like it also says what is in here. I'm gonna try to avoid looking at that until I actually get the products out here because I don't want to spoil anything for myself. So the first thing that is on top here looks to be like a mask of some sort. So it says it's a herbal collagen and retinal cherub eye mask. Eye masks are not something that I really ever use. It's like, it's one of those things that, okay, I'm, I'm very lazy, I will admit that. Like spending time on skincare is not something that I enjoy and it's something that I just completely forget unless it's like the very basics, like taking my makeup off at night and stuff. So like eye masks is like, very high maintenance for me, so I probably won't use these and I will probably give them to someone else, but let's see how much these are costing. So it says here that they are $15.50. I don't know if that is for one pack or for two packs, but I'm gonna assume that it comes with a pack of four like this. So, I mean, that's a really cool thing that I can give to someone that I know is going to really love those. So, oh, next up in the box looks to be something that I actually own already. And this is a brush set from Cleona Cosmetics from their stained glass collection. Like I said, I already own these because they were so kind to send them to me and I really do appreciate that. So I will show you one of the brushes that I do have. This is one of the eyeshadow brushes. Uh, this is what the handle looks like. They're absolutely stunning brushes and I'm so happy that I was able to get another set because I actually have a friend of mine that's been asking me about some new brushes so I will probably give them to her because I think that she would really like those. So let me see what these retail for. So this set costs $24.50. So already we have, let's see, $40 worth of products which is awesome. That's about the cost of the box. I think I pay $39 per box. If I'm wrong, I will correct myself on the screen, but I think that's what this box costs. So next up in the box looks to be a lipstick from Gerard Cosmetics. I've actually tried their lipsticks in the past and I ended up buying two, uh, two of which colors I ended up not liking at all, so I decluttered them. So I don't really know how I feel about the Gerard Cosmetics uh, lipsticks. So let me open this up and see what color we got in here. So this is one of the Hydra mattes. So looking from the tube, it looks to be kind of like a, a brownie, nudie color, but like on the darker side. So it's definitely a bit on the darker side. So let's just give this a quick swatch here. Yeah, that's a very, very beautiful warm tone brown. I'm not mad at that at all. I already like this color so much more than the colors that I bought myself last time. I'm gonna go ahead and wipe this off so it doesn't stain my hand too bad here. But I'm excited to try that because I really do want to give their formula another chance here. So let's see, <laughs> next up I see a little box in here that says may cause euphoria. I don't know what's in this, I have no clue. It's from the brand Vixen. Venus Scale Beauté. So Venus Scale Beauté, I've never heard of that. It is a intense pigment for an edgy chrome effect. So it's a multi-chrome pigment, it costs $18, so, oh god, I'm excited about this. I can't wait to open this because I love me good multi-chrome anything. Now, not the hugest fan of like loose pigments, but I can definitely see myself giving this a chance if it looks nice. So here's what the little container looks like, and it looks to be kind of like one of the ones I have from Cleona already with like a purple to orange to red kind of shift in it, but it looks really, really nice. I don't want to open this because I don't want to make a mess right now, but let's move into the last two products in here. So it looks like we have an eyeshadow palette and I don't know what this is. 
is a Makeup Geek highlighter. All right, well, I haven't really tried anything from Makeup Geek, so I am excited about this. This one retails for $15, so let's go ahead and open this. I got mine in the shade Celestial. So this is what the packaging looks like. Let me know if you guys have tried anything from Makeup Geek. I feel like I just got into makeup a little bit too late to like get the hype for Makeup Geek because when I got into makeup, Makeup Geek wasn't really that hyped up and popular anymore. And this looks to be a very, very, very light highlighter. I don't know if I will be able to use this, but let's give it a quick swatch here. So, I mean, the color of this is beautiful. It's almost like a lavender. And I feel like this might be just too light for me. Yeah, I don't know if I'll be able to use that, but I will try to give that a go at a different time. Like I said, I am waiting to put on highlighter right now because I'm waiting for another package. But let's see what the uh, palette in here is. So this is a Glam Light palette called Miracle. I have never seen this. Let's see what it says on this thing. This one costs $28. It says the Miracle palette is a tribute to all of the brave women in the world who have been affected by breast cancer. It is a stunning rose color story, the perfect palette for subtle and glam looks. Should I even open this? <laughs> I feel like I'm going to be giving this away for sure to someone else because I can't see myself really loving this. Oh, actually, that's quite nice. That is way more like colorful than what I was expecting. And this is so Angelica. I'm not surprised at all that this is in here. And I really like how all of the things kind of go together, like color-wise. I feel like they did a really good job curating this. So I'm honestly excited about this box, even though I don't really think that I would use like a lot of these things on a regular basis, but I'm excited to give away a lot of these items. I will probably pop a lot of these things into a giveaway and stuff like that. And then I will also give some of these things to, you know, some of my friends. And like I said, I also do have another box coming. So I'll probably just do like a separate giveaway with the box when I do get it. But I don't want to put that into this video because I don't know if I'll actually get it. Like, I'm pretty sure I will, but it will come to my PO box and not to my regular address. So I just don't really know what the situation is there. So I don't want to promise a giveaway until I've gotten the other box. So I will definitely do that at some point, but I'm still excited about getting this box and I'm really excited for Angelica to be able to be part of this. That is so cool. I would love to know if any of you guys got this box. I'm sure some of you did because you guys love Angelica as much as I do. So that's gonna be it for today's video. Uh, let me know which product in here was your favorite and what you would like the most. I think my favorite was probably the Gerard Cosmetics lipstick somehow, but I'm honestly a little bit excited about the palette too because I definitely do want to try that because it did look really, really nice. So yeah, thank you so much for watching and one of my Anatomist videos. If you want to see some other videos that I've done in December, you can click on one of these. And if you're new to my channel, I would love it if you would consider subscribing and I will see you in tomorrow's video. Bye.